guys, welcome to another video. So today, we're going to be taking a look at some of Madame Glam's April collection. So this month's destination is Hollywood. And this collection's a little bit different to the previous ones. This month's collection is made up of 15 gorgeous creamy gel polishes that's been split into three mini collections. Now what I mean by mini collections is, I don't mean mini bottles, you're still getting your 15 mil. I mean the 15 different gel polish colors has been split into three mini collections of five gel polishes. So the first mini collection is called Glamour and that is made up of five, Madame Glam say five white shades. I would actually call them greenish, grey and white. What I'll do is guys, I'll pop a picture on the screen showing you the collections as I'm telling you about them, then you can take a look at them. The second mini collection is called Fame, which is made up of five different shades of pink. And then the third mini collection is called Power, and that's made up of five different shades of red. So I was asked to choose five of my favourite shades and I chose Venice Beach, The Boardwalk, Grand Canyon, Rodeo Drive and then these two I couldn't decide which one I wanted out of these two, Millennium and Water Tower. So I asked them to send me whichever they wanted to send me and they sent me both of them. Thank you so much. So, what we're going to do today is, we are going to give them a very quick swatch. I don't want to spend too much time swatching them, so I'll probably do one or two in real time, and then I'll speed the swatching up, because there's a design that I want to do with these colours, and it's going to be quite a long one, so yeah. Let's crack straight on with it, shall we? So, first one is Rodeo Drive. Really, really beautiful pink, that. Really nice, bright pink. I can see me using that quite a lot. Gorgeous, bright pink, that. Love that. And these Madame Glam gel polishes cure in an LED light for 30 seconds. And I feel like I'm repeating myself in all my Madame Glam videos, guys. But for those of you that haven't heard of Madame Glam gel polishes before, I just want to quickly tell you that they are all vegan, cruelty-free, 21-free formula, palm oil-free, and hemma-free. And they're really, really good quality gel polishes. Next one is Grand Canyon. Ooh, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous pillar box red. The minute I saw this red, I knew that I had to have it because I haven't got a Madame Glam red. And that is so opaque. Wow. Reds can be a little bit hit and miss. I find some reds can be really sheer, I think. Some companies have issues with them either being too sheer or they're nice and opaque but they end up wrinkling in the lamp. Now I have not found any Madame Glam gel polishes that wrinkle in the lamp. None. Madame Glam always get their formula bang on. Now look at that guys for one coat of a red. That is just amazing amazing coverage i wouldn't even need two coats on that one coater for a red can you believe that next up is venice beach again look at that coverage 
one coat. Wow, beautiful colour as well. The boardwalk. Gorgeous, pretty light pink. I really like that. And we've got water tower. Ooh, that is beautiful. Light, super light grey. Really nice colour. And then last but not least, we have got Millennium. Oh, I like this. It's like a, a creamy colour. Oh, I really like that. Look at that. Really pretty creamy colour. Beautiful. So there we are. That is them all swatched. What do you think? I think they are all really, really pretty. And they have all only had one coat. Now most of you guys know that I do usually do like to do two coats. I just find it makes most gel polishes more vibrant. But they're not going to get any more vibrant than that. Look at those. It was just, a, it would just be a complete waste of product to put two coats on there. It really would. No issues with curing. Cured absolutely perfect. Lovely and smooth. I've also given them a coat of the Madame Glam's No Wipe Shiny Top Coat on the top half. And the Madame Glam's Velvet Matte Top Coat on the bottom half. Which is, they're both my favourite top coats. The shiny and the matte. Really nice top coats. So, that's them all swatched. Now, I'm going to do a design with them. I've got a couple of designs in mind what I want to do with these colours. So, I'm still undecided as to which I'm going to do. I thought I'll swatch them first so I can take a proper look at them. And then, I was hoping that I was going to know which design to do. Obviously, I'm going to do both designs, but I didn't know what design to do in this video. And I'm still undecided. Um, well, I'm going to get set up anyway. And then once I'm set up, I'll decide which design I'm going to do. So I shall pop back in in a minute. I'm going to start off by giving them all a coat of the boardwalk. So I'm going to give them a quick cure for 30 seconds, then I'll do a second coat off camera guys, just to save time. Ooh, look at that pink. I can see me using that a lot. That is a beautiful pink. So now I'm going to remove that tacky layer of that gel polish, because I'm going to be going in with some foil glue. And this is a really good tip actually that I learned off my girl Aggie. If you're applying foil glue and you don't get rid of that tacky layer, your foil glue doesn't work nowhere near as good. I was really struggling with my McCart foil glue and so many people rave about it and it was because I was leaving the tacky layer of my gel polish on the nails. So that is a really good tip for you there guys if you've not heard of that one before. So now I want to see where I'm going to be putting some of these flowers. So I'm doing a full nail on the middle, the top half on the pinky and the bottom half on the 
index finger. I'm thinking I might cut these out and just use what I want rather than keeping them as they are. I mean, that could stay as it is. Put that. Mm. Yeah, that could stay as it is like that, I guess. And then just add a couple more at the top like that. Mm. So I'm now using the McCart Foil Glue Gel. This glue gel, guys, is absolutely amazing. I can't believe I was struggling so bad with it before because I wasn't getting rid of that tacky layer. So this nail is going to have a full coat. I think I'm going to do all the nails individually, actually, because I like to apply the foil while this glue gel is still warm as soon as it comes out the lamp. So I don't want to be faffing about with this one and then the others go cold. So yeah, I think I'm going to do them separately. Now it does say to cure this for 30 seconds, but in my lamp, I find 45 is better. So I'm going to cure it for 45 seconds. So who's ready to see if this comes straight off? Do, do, do. Let's have a look. Start with this one, I think. Let's start with this one. Perfect. Perfect. And then the last one. So that is that one done. Now the pinky and the index, I can do them together because they're only half each. That's not going to be an issue. When you're applying this, you want to make sure you apply a nice even layer as well. Don't need too much. I could have applied that just to the half where I'm sticking this foil, but I didn't want it to be like a lip. So I'm going to cure them for 45 seconds. So that's the foils all applied. I think they're really cute. I actually like them in black and white, but I want to show you that these transfer foils, you haven't got to use them for a certain time of year. You can actually colour them in, which is what I'm going to do with these Madame Glam gel polishes. And you can use them all year round, depending on what colour you're going to colour them in with. I think that's really, really cool. Just gonna colour them all in now. I'm using the Madame Glam's Detail Liner Brush. Really nice brush this is. Super duper thin bristles. Really nice brush.
Now, I'm not gonna cure them because I now want to kind of fade some of this pink into it like this. Like that. And in the middle, I'm just gonna do the red. I'm going to give that a quick flash cure. So now I'm using the Madame Glam's No Wipe Top Coat, and this is their shiny top coat. I'm going to apply that to all four nails. And then before I cure that, I'm just going to sprinkle some of this beautiful sugar plum glitter, which is from Charlie's Nail Art. And I just want to find my little, little do flop. Pop that under there like that. I love this glitter, it's absolutely beautiful. So, what I want to do is I want to move these nails out the way like that. So I don't want to get any glitter on these for the nails. And then I want a tiny bit. I don't know how I'm going to do this though. Because I only want it. Actually, I know what I'm going to do. On the pinky, I'm going to apply it with a brush because I don't want it to go over that silver line. Right, then I'm going to give them all a cure for 60 seconds. The Madame Glam shiny top coat actually cures in 30 seconds. But I just want to make sure that it's all cured underneath that glitter. So I'm going to give it a double cure for 60 seconds. So there we are, guys. That is them all done. Cute little floral design. Using Madame Glam's new April gel polish collection. Just to recap, the name of this collection is Glamour Fame Power. As always guys, you'll see in the top right hand corner of the screen is my Madame Glam discount code, GG30. So anyone that wants to place an order, click the link in my description box, that will take you over to the website, and then at checkout enter GG30, that way you'll save yourself a massive 30% off your order. Also Madame Glam do a VIP membership as well. Anyone that's interested in finding out more about that, you'll find all the information that you need on that when you head on over to the website. Let's take a quick look at the swatches again, shall we? So that is them all swatched. Again, like I said, one coat as guys. None of them needed two coats. None of them. They are super pigmented. They're just absolutely amazing quality. Madam Glam never ever disappoint so yeah that's them all swatched they've all had a coat of the shiny top coat and the madame glam's velvet matte top coat really really cute collection don't you think love them i want to say a massive thank you to madame glam for sending me these to try they're absolutely stunning really good quality beautiful colors love them 
And I think it's nice that they split this collection into three mini collections as well. You can just buy each mini collection individually. I think that's a really good idea. So yeah, that's everything for today's video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please remember to give it a thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, I'd love it if you would. Don't forget to hit the little notification bell with your notifications turned on. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. And I hope to see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.